What is a query? What is a report? If you need to run an export from a tapestry of all donors that gave last year, is this a query? Is it a report? Is it both? These are common questions that we hear from eTapestry users. Sometimes it isn't clear that queries and reports are two different features in your eTapestry database, but both contribute to reporting. Whether you're an eTapestry database administrator or a user that occasionally dabbles in eTapestry reporting, it is important to understand the nuances between eTapestry queries and eTapestry reports. To explain the differences between queries and reports, we need to start at the end of the reporting process. When someone in your organization is curious about fundraising or donor data, they might ask for all donors that gave last year, a mailing list for the end of year appeal, a list of new donors this year, major donors that gave more than $5,000 in the last two years, year over year comparison of total giving, or attendees for last year's annual gala. You ultimately want to create an export of data to Excel or a formatted PDF, so you start with the reports feature in a tapestry. That makes sense. You want to run a report, so you navigate to the reports feature and start building. But in eTapestry, the reports feature alone won't get you the final Excel or PDF export you might expect. What you might think of as a report is actually a three-step process that includes both a query and a report. In step one, you'll build a query. In step two, you'll build a report. And in step three, you run the report with the query. You must follow this three-step process to generate a report from eTapestry. There are no exceptions. To define these two features further, let's use an example report that you might want to run. Let's say we want to run a report on total giving last year with contact information for all donors that gave last year. We first need to start with our query definition. A query is a search function that finds a specific set of records from your database. Records in eTapestry are data elements like accounts or journal entries. A query finds records based on a specific set of search criteria and bundles those records together in a group. Alternatively, you can think of a query as a filter. While the results of a query can be exported, a query doesn't display data, report data, or format data in what you might think of as a report. It only finds specific records in your database. For the example report we want to build in this video, our query will be all donors that gave last year. Let's take a look at how we'd set that up. First, we want to build our query from all constituents in our database, and we want our query to return constituent account records. Next, we will need to select the criteria to filter or refine our search. We want to return constituent account records that have a received transaction. This is captured using the individual transaction received field and entering an amount greater than $0. We also need to make sure to capture only those donors who gave last year. To accomplish this, add the journal entry date field and set the range to last year. This is a dynamic value, so even if we run this query with a report in a future year, it'll continue to populate the previous year's data. If your base query contains all accounts, the query example we built only shows those accounts that gave last year. The query will filter out the records that do not meet our criteria, which are the records that we don't want, and will filter in or select the records that do match our criteria and we want included in our report. Let's move into talking about our report definition. A report is a template that displays the records returned in a query. A report prior to being ran with a query is blank. A blank report has column headers, and each column header identifies a field in your eTapestry database. Using the example we've used in this video, the report we want to build should have total giving and contact information. More specifically, we might want to add the following fields to our report. Name, 
address information, email, phone number, and one year ago received amount. Stated differently, our report needs to show the contact information. With this, you might want to see phone numbers, email addresses, and mailing addresses, and we've listed those fields for this report. But for whom do we want to see the contact information? That is where the query that we created comes into play. Records returned in a query populate the rows in the report. When you run the report, you populate the records returned by the query in the report structure you built. After you've created your report definition, click Run Report. You can run your report with any query in your database. However, not all queries will return the results you're hoping to capture in your report. It's best to build your query and report simultaneously to ensure you're capturing the desired constituent account records and report fields. Using the query we built earlier, we can run this new report to return the results we want, which is total giving last year with contact information for all donors who gave last year. This report can be downloaded in a variety of file formats to suit our needs. E-Tapestry reports require both a query and a report. We need simple ways to break down our reporting projects because there are separate steps to achieve what you need as a final export from eTapestry. An eTapestry reporting narrative is the best way to simplify the reporting process. Simply write out the specifications of the report you want in a text editor or Word document. Then separate the components of your narrative into the query and the report. For the all donors who gave last year report we've built in this video, the reporting narrative may look something like this. We want to run a report showing name, address, city, state, postal code, email, and one year ago received amount, as the fields in the report, for all constituents with received transaction greater than zero dollars and a journal entry date of last year, which is our query. At Sidekick Solutions, we are consultants that specialize in eTapestry. Spend your time focusing on what matters to you while we handle your database and help you get the most from it. Do you have questions about eTapestry? Explore more best practices on our website at sidekicksolutionsllc.com forward slash eTapestry or contact us today at info at sidekicksolutionsllc.com.